Eric Crawford here, owner of Ultra Pure Systems. If you've ever smelt that fishy odor that comes from ultrasonic humidifiers, and it seems like it happens at the worst times of year when we need humidification the most, well, there's a very specific reason for it. So hopefully this helps. Most manufacturers require or at least recommend deionized water, DI water, go to the ultrasonic humidifiers. The reason for it is that deionized resin is a very good catalyst to remove all the minerals out of the water. DI resin is made up of two compounds, an anion bead and a cation bead, a positive and a negative charged, very small plastic bead. And as water passes over DI resin, it exchanges the positive and negative charge for the minerals in the water and we have going out of the, uh, the, the fiberglass tank, very clean water, it works great. Most manufacturers and also service companies utilize what's referred to as a type one DI resin. Type one resin is abundant and it's used in many, many processes and it works great. However, in ultrasonic humidification, it poses a concern. You see type one resin on the anion bead has a group in it called trimethylamine. And in that group has amine or ammonia on it. And as DI resin gets, goes bad or is exhausted, the amine is de it degrades. And when it degrades, it gets into the water. And that's the problem. And when it gets into the water, it gets into the very fine mist and that's your fishy odor. DI resin doesn't work like soft water systems that has a regeneration mode that when it goes into regeneration, it exchanges all the calcium and the magnesium in the water with sodium chloride or salt. And then it goes back into normal operations. So you don't have to really do anything with soft water except just add salt. So that's the fishy odor that is coming off is because the DI resin is exhausted and you're utilizing a type one resin. Well, here's the good news. Ultra Pure Systems doesn't utilize type one resin. We use a very different resin that doesn't have that compound on the anion bead. So we will never have that fishy odor that comes from our ultrasonic humidifiers. If you have any questions or if you would like to see the cut sheet on the chemistry of the DI resin that we use, you could go to our website and it is there for your viewing. Hopefully this helps, enjoy.